me, I came up with this great idea that I will do taco tasting for people who are like traveling in. When my family would come visit, the first thing I did after I picked them up from the airport was to bring them to a taco stand before taking them home. And I figured this is something that um, everybody will like, so I submitted the idea. They approved it and then people started booking me. I think I did like five tours and then it got shut down because of COVID. And then September of 2020, people are starting to come out. Whoever is in town and wants to get tacos with me, yeah. come down. I'm really looking forward to all these taco stops. This is the only hole in the wall that I love because they have seafood tacos. having shrimp tacos. They treat us so well. We have tacos de camarón, some green sauce, pico de gallo, handmade tortillas right there in the window. So there's proof. I'm gonna take a bite of this. I like that. Good. It's bright. And the shrimp is, is fresh too. And you don't need to be seaside to get good shrimp tacos, right? What experience did you have with tacos before this? I just love tacos. I'm <laughs> yeah, originally yeah. Ghanaian, so flavor is okay, yeah. like what I seek in food. And in terms of like culture and cuisine, the closest thing to like the flavors that I used to and I crave are Mexican food. Yeah. And tacos are simple. I live in this neighborhood. Every day from work, I will stop at the taco stand before I get him home. I can eat tacos every day. <laughs> so, I actually started a hot sauce um, business this year. So it's Flores Chateau. Chateau is, I would say, the national hot sauce of Ghana. Okay. And every street food um, you will get, Chateau will be used to garnish it. I figured this is something that people would be interested in yep. knowing about. Where all of the stands I'm taking you to these are kind of like my top five favorite. This is as close to authentic Mexican taco without having to go to Tijuana. I did a 24 hour trip to Tijuana, did taco tasting, walked around, drove to Ensenada. That's more seafood taco, ate more seafood tacos there. 24 hour crash course in being a taco expert. And now I trust you even more. So we are at the last of the three Mar Vista taco stands, right? This the recommendation was the chicken taco. It's also handmade fresh tortillas. And I'm gonna take a big bite. With the guacamole. That's lemon. Mm -hmm. And the chicken's a smoky grill flavor. But a lot of pop. Crispy taco. Got this spicy habanero on it. Yeah. It's flavorful. Mm -hmm. I'm really enjoying the flavor profiles that I'm experiencing here. And it's simple, you know, it's like cilantro, uh, habaneros, probably some shishito pepper influence. But every single bite is satisfying, it's filling. That's what we like about LA tacos. And it's really tender street. I like I like the speed, I like the hospitality. 